Another thing I feel like is really important, like for making like some triplet drops bounce or flow really nicely is to have like opposing notes. Like as far as like one is like half time and one is double time. Then you have the arp and then the arp is like twice the speed as like the regular chords. And then the same thing applies like with the bass. I feel like if I had all the notes playing like the exact same speed notes, like one of them, like if, if all of them were just the exact same length, it wouldn't bounce as much. It wouldn't feel as energetic. It would kind of just feel like more sluggish, slow. So like having best of both worlds is nice because if I had the original chords going the same speed as the bass notes, it would just feel too fast for me. It will just feel like it's too much. I don't know. So I feel like that balance is really nice. So whenever you feel like because sometimes you make notes and then like you have them, how they are arpeggiating or how they are like repeating, they're too fast or they're too slow. So it's really nice to be able to have one that's that slower pace and then have like your bass notes be like a faster like your pace. bass notes, if that be like a faster pace. Absolutely, dude. In our first episode of In the Doll with Trivecta, he was mm -hmm. breaking down his really big remix he did for Elenium for Fractures. And he taught mm -hmm. this exact concept. And he's like, dude, if you really want to do some, like make your super not just super saws, but whenever you're layering things together, oh my gosh, like have them do counter rhythms and counter melodies yeah. and all that kind of stuff. And I don't even know if that's the proper term. That's just the term he used. But like, it's so much better than just something going dun, 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 dun. You know, you kind of have mm -hmm. all these things kind of working together in this really beautiful dance of notes and music. Exactly, you know I mean? man. It's, it's really important. What's up, Dot Nation? I hope you enjoyed this quick tip episode with Zan Griffin, which by the way, if you want to see the entire In The Dot episode that we did with him and get even more value, go ahead up over here here in the top right corner. You can click that link that's showing up right now. It'll take you to the full episode that we did with him. Also down in the description is a link of the full episode, as well as down in the comments, the top pinned comment will have the link over to that episode as well. Which by the way, Zan Griffin and Don Nation came together and we created something absolutely insane. So Zan Griffin created an album about a year ago called the Zodiac Album. It went on to have over a hundred million streams. All right, it was a very, very, very successful album. And guess what he did? He broke down the entire album. You get to see how every single song in that album is broken down. You also get project files, stems, uh, bonus presets, bonus samples. There's a whole bunch of stuff inside of there, which is just absolutely amazing. So if you're interested in finding out more about that, to learn how an album that had over a hundred million streams was made, so you can actually see it and start applying those principles to your own music today, then I highly encourage you to go over to dawnation.net. That is where the masterclass lives. You can head on over there and get more information if you want to. But right now we are running a very special deal because it's the launch of this new masterclass. Okay. So the deal is it's 50% off. It's usually $200. Right now it is $97 and you get all of the bonuses. But once this deal is done, it shoots back up to $200 and you don't get the bonuses. So I'd highly encourage you to go over to dawnation.net and to check out the masterclass over there. But Dawnation, if you want to keep getting better and better at music production by learning from huge music producers that have already made it in the music industry that I'd highly encourage you to go down, press the subscribe button and the little notification bell as well. So donation with all that out of the way, we really hope you enjoyed this little quick tip. And by the way, keep coming back here every couple of days because we are constantly just putting out more and more content that's going to help you as a music producer. But with all that out of the way, donation, you're amazing. And we'll see you on the next quick tip video.